Hey guys, it's Kelly. Welcome back. Today I have another Shop With Me at Target video and I'm so excited. I'm just getting ready to leave. This is the second one of these that I'm filmed. I've had so many requests to do another one, so we're about to leave. Just want to share a little outfit before we go. It's like such a nasty rainy day, so it's pretty dark in here, but I actually have on my Target jeans. I want to try to find some more like this. These are from the Wild Fable line. These shoes are also from Target. I don't know that they have these anymore. They're from a couple, like maybe two seasons ago or two years ago, I mean. This top I got at the thrift store. Look how cute it is. It has this little, it's so dark, floral detail at the neck. And then I have on my little Angela Roy bag. This is like a belt bag, but I'm wearing it crossbody today. I'll link it below. And let's go ahead and head to Target. Are you a good boy? Are you a good boy? Are you? Are you excited for us to go to Target? Do you hope we bring you home some snacks? Lots of really cute bridal stuff in the dollar section too. They had a Vineyard Vines dog collection. These are so adorable. Kaz could really use a new bow tie, actually. I don't know if these are his style, though. Got some bandanas. These are a little big for him. These would be for like a large dog, I feel like. Some toys. Cute bags. Honey. <laughs> This line right here is supposed to be like Levi's for Target and they have a bunch of them here in different colors Yeah, it's not bad at all. This dress is super cute. It's a maxi and it's the A New Day brand. So soft. I always love the earrings from Target. This Sugar Fix line is like Bobble Bar for Target. And it's so cute. They have bracelets and earrings. Ooh, these are super cute little crabs. So cute. Oh, I saw Jessica Braun wearing these in a video recently. I think they're adorable. I feel like you should get these because they're cancer. Is this a crab? No, it's a lobster. <laughs> And I love the earrings from A New Day. I got actually these ones, but in white last time I was here. Wait, these little fanny packs are so cute. This purple one is adorable. What brand is this? A New Day. They have purple, pink, and a different material. They have a lot of cute ones. Oh, and these are very similar to the ones that I have on now. These ones are from, like I said, a year or two ago. Then they have these ones currently very similar, basically the same. Okay, this bodysuit from Wild Fable is so cute. It's like a square neck, but it has a little dip in it. I think I'm going to try this on. Okay, like I've said, their jeans are my favorite. And I've been looking for some black ones. And these are super cute. So I'm definitely going to try those on. And some more fanny packs we have cheetah print and then black and then this one is really cute it's like holographic clear who else is so excited 
for the new Aladdin movie. Oh my gosh, I can't wait! Okay, I've been wanting to pick up a lash primer and I've heard that this one from CoverGirl is pretty good. I want to get the Essence one, but they don't sell Essence, at least not at my Target. I don't think most Targets do. But I think I might pick this up. They also have a lot of really adorable things for Father's Day. This little tie. This is Chill Dad. This is Papa. And my favorite, this is my dad, Mr. Fix It. Also, number one dad wallets, bank of dad, best dad ever. These are so cute. Okay, we actually have a record player, so I kind of am tempted to get this. This album recently celebrated its 20th anniversary, Britney Spears' debut album. Actually, there's so this many good <laughs> records in here. Stranger Things, Derek, did you hear the new seasons coming out this summer? Yeah, Joshua. Right, now that you guys have seen all of the little shopping clips, it is the next day and I wanted to share with you guys what I actually picked up, just kind of a mini haul. I honestly didn't get a ton. Um, let's start with one thing you saw on camera. I picked up the CoverGirl Vitalist, no, that's a different product. I picked up the CoverGirl Lash Blast Amplify Mascara Primer and I used it for the first time today and it's hard to say, this is, oh my gosh, it's stuck in my hair. It's hard to say if it worked or not just because it's the first time using it and I feel like you have to use these products a few times to really coat the wand and see what you think. But so far I actually do feel like maybe I saw a little bit of a difference but I need to test it out some more and make sure that's not just all in my head. Also, I picked up a little gift bag. I am going to be going to a bachelorette party soon so I have some gifts that I needed to get a bag for so this is perfect. This was in the little dollar section up front and you guys this is cuter than any bag that I probably would have found at like TJ Maxx or Marshalls or anything and it's so much cheaper. It was on sale for 50 cents. It has these little pink and purple polka dots and then you have the purple wrapping paper 
and I don't know if it was supposed to be from Valentine's Day or if it's from a bridal collection because it was sitting with all the bridal stuff, which is why I picked it up, but I think this bag is really adorable, and I'm gonna use that this weekend. And my friend whose present is going to be in that bag is probably watching this video, so hi, Emma. There is one more thing that I actually am not gonna share on camera because I got something for my dad and I know that he watches all of my videos so I know that he would see this, but just know they have so many cute Father's Day stuff. I shared some clips in the previous section so I definitely recommend checking out Target. And the final thing that I picked up was this t-shirt that you saw me trying on. It is the Rolling Stones shirt. And this I got from the men's section, but I got it in a size small and it fits kind of like a unisex size small would. The only complaint that I have about this is that I wish that the graphic looked a little bit distressed because the shirt is distressed and bleached, but the graphic looks like brand new. But I really cannot complain because it was $12.99 and they had so many cute tees. So if you just like to wear simple little graphic tees like this, I definitely recommend checking out the men's section, but they also had a lot of really cute ones in the women's section as well. You guys also saw me try on those Wild Fable jeans and I wanted to love those. I was so excited about them because the other two pairs of Wild Fable jeans that I have, I'm so obsessed with. But that style, I don't know if you could tell in the clips, but it was just very big. And their jeans, for the most part, run like very large. Like I'm typically about a two, but in all of their jeans, I'm a double zero except for the skinny ones. If I get a double zero, those are too tight. So they fit a little bit funny. I definitely recommend trying them on. But those ones that I tried on in the store fit way baggier than all of my other double zeros from Wild Fable. And I know it was supposed to be like a wider fit, but even the waist was just way too big. So it was a no. Also the bodysuit, I didn't love the way that it fit, but I'm excited about this. I didn't feel like they had as many cute clothing items as usual at Target right now. I don't know if it's just because they're kind of between seasons, but they did have a ton of really cute summer stuff for like outdoor parties and for the pool. So if that's what you're looking for, definitely recommend Target. But I didn't feel like they had as much in the clothing section this round, but Hope you guys enjoyed this Shop With Me at Target vlog style video. If you do want to see more like this, let me know by giving the video a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.